Aspirin is the most common use of medicine because of its analgesic and anti-inflammation. Do you know willow bark is the father of aspirin? With the thousands of years, willow bark has been used for pain relief. And thanks to the modern research, scientists they invented aspirin based on the chemicals found within the willow bark. Comparatively, willow bark have a less allergic effect, but keep the medical benefits of pain relief and anti-inflammation. In this video, I will show you how to extract willow bark by steam distillation. Use of a willow bark for pain relief traces back to almost 4,000 years ago. And in the 18th century, Edward Stone, the Oxford scientist, started using the willow bark to treat a fever. In 1890s, the German dye manufacturer Bayer, they started their pharmaceutical division and their first product is aspirin. This makes a success of Bayer change into a pharmaceutical company. And in 1982, Nobel Prize awarded to the scientist John Vanay because he discovered how aspirin work to help reduce pain and anti-inflammation. A double-blind clinical trial study, they found out the willow bark extract has moderate analgesic effect to the arthritis with a good tolerance from the patients. Another piece of a pharmacokinetic study, they concluded the active ingredients within the willow bark is not only the celsin that is uh, equal to the aspirin, but also other polyphenol and the flavonoids. This synergetic effect between this group of chemicals makes the benefits. Scientists use mass spectrum to measure the chemical composition within the willow bark extract. They identified 13 different uh, salicylate group chemicals, including the salicin and the salicylic acid. Salicylic acid can be produced within the plant as a hormone that can help manage the plants during the insect invasion and water shortage. Salicylic acid is a volatile compound. It can be extracted out of the willow bark by distillation and go into the distillate. Salicylic acid has an exfoliating effect on the skin cells. It's good to clean the dead cell and treat acne. And after the steam distillation, I will show you do the actual treatment on the steamed willow bark to collect the salicin and other polyphenol and the flavonoids and that will be the next coming video and today i'm going to show you just the steam distillation part to make the hydrosol from a willow bark and that is a good facial spray to help clean the skin and help the anti-inflammation today i'm using the lead time kd5 that is an upgraded cattle distiller if you are familiar with the lead time product that was uh, the cattle distiller was invented by lead time and now it's upgraded into uh, this uh, new version uh, the steamer so the plant material will go into this little jar it's uh, about one cup of volume and the water go into the the pot and also you can do the hydro distillation if you mix some material with this but I normally recommend steam distillation because it's easy control. And this is the condenser. You can add an ice cube in this and do the condensation and then collect the distillate. Uh, it takes less space compared with the LT3000. That's a larger uh, version of the home distiller. Uh, so I will show you step by step how to do the uh, steam distillation with the KD5.
After 45 minutes, I collected one cup of the hydrosol. With one batch of the material, normally one cup to 500 milliliter is the recommended amount of hydrosol to make. As always, I'm gonna show you the color of the hydrosol. Uh, obviously not as milky as uh, lavender or other high oil content material. Uh, it makes sense because the willow bark has a low oil. It does have a very strong the willow bark uh, smell. Because of the nature low salicylic acid content within the willow bark, uh, it generally it's uh, safe to use directly. You're always recommended to test at a skin before you spray use as a facial spray and make sure you don't have an allergy. Uh, generally speaking, willow bark is uh, more safer than aspirin because uh, it's a combination of the, all the chemicals together. But you always test before you use it. So now finish the first session of this extraction process. That is a steam distillation to make a hydrosol. And the next video, I will show you how to deal with those plant material after distillation and do the alcohol extraction and following distillation to make you a high concentrated extract without alcohol. Okay, hopefully you learned something today about willow bark and aspirin. Uh, like the video and share the video with the friends who want to know more about medicinal herb benefits and how to extract. See you next time.